Well, let's say they gave me the two roots. Now, the roots is where we cut the x-axis. Let's say they gave me the two roots. Now, we know where we cut the x-axis is where fx is equal to 0. In other words, if we would have had our expression, our parabola or quadratic expression, and we would made it equal to 0, then the two answers that we'll get in the end would have been x equal to r1 and x equal to r2. That would have been my two answers, and that's where I made my intercepts. So, the step just before this one was when I had, well, x minus r1 is equal to 0, and x minus r2 must be equal to 0. Okay, and this must have come from another step before this that said that if I had the two brackets, x minus r1 multiplied by x minus r2, then those two brackets gave me 0. That's why one of them had to be 0. And now I see R. Oh, if I multiply out these two brackets, then I will get an expression that looks like that. Okay? So, if I do, I just want to make myself some space, if I do multiply it out, I get x squared, but then I see, oh, there's a problem. That x squared has an a in front, which means that we need to put an a in front here as well. And what might have happened before we uh, found the solution was we divided both sides with an a because 0 divided by a would have just still been 0. We could have done that. So there might have been an a there initially. And I don't need to go and do all of the steps back because now I see this expression represents f of x. So another formula or format in which I can write my uh, quadratic function is in the format a x minus root 1 multiplied by x minus root 2. And again we see the parameters that we have to solve. There's three parameters. We have parameter a, parameter r1 and parameter r2 where r1 and r2 represents the um, x-intercepts and they are given to me which means um, or they are also called roots which means I still have one parameter left to solve and in order to solve it I must add they must give me any other point as well so a point other than the, uh, the x-intercepts and then I'll be able to do it.